morning here on Good Morning Central Oregon. I'm Christy Miller on the program today. Robert Killen he is back from the City Club of Central Oregon to talk about forums and presentations that they have coming up this month that you are invited to. With the holiday season on the way, there are ways that you can help the animals through the Humane Society of Central Oregon. We'll learn how to do just that. And the seventh annual Holiday Magic Concerts are coming up. They benefit our friends at Abilla Tree, which is formerly Coral. We'll talk about those events as well. But first, my first guest is author Jean Nave. Her latest book is Harry and Lola Meet Santa Claus. And of course, she brought with her the stars of the book series, Harry and Lola. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Well, I am thrilled to have you back. I know you've now written four other Harry and Lola books. What was the inspiration for Harry and Lola Meet Santa Claus? Well, uh, this summer we were, my husband and I were sitting and having breakfast and uh, we both discussed the idea that, gee, there ought to be a Christmas book because after all these are kids' books. Mm -hmm. And so we were kicking around, you know, I was saying, well, gee, maybe, you know, Harry and Lola meet Santa Claus. And my husband says, well, how about Harry and Lola meet Santa Claus? <laughs> and I said, well, gee, that sounds great. And I had not heard of the other Santa Claus, but that was the uh, original thing of let's have Harry and Lola meet Santa Claus. And what inspired you to start writing about these guys in the first place? Well, the the puppies are rescued. There are two rescue Scotties, and they now have a third one that has just joined the home. And when um, when we got involved, I learned that Scotty Rescue, well, all dog rescue, but Scotty Rescue in particular is really hurting financially here in Oregon. So I wanted to help, and I'd written books in the past for big people, not little people. And so I thought that, uh, well, maybe if we do some kind of a kids' book, that will help get some attention, and who knows, maybe it will even generate some mm -hmm. revenue. So mm -hmm. we've ended up doing both. So it, it's been great, and it's been so much fun. It is so much fun to write kids' books. And we spent the whole summer reading the books at Blackfeet Ranch and at the uh, uh, Sisters Elementary School's um, free lunch program. Mm -hmm. We read them, so we have read books to probably hundreds of kids at this point. And and Harry, Harry and Lola accompany you on each of those readings? Yes, right? if, we're, if we're not in a public school, because they, they are not, you have to have them, they have to be companion sure. uh, uh, pets to go into the school, but uh, if we're not in a public school, the kids can see the puppies, and of course that's really the big deal. Well, they are so well behaved. Okay. I mean, not just because she's been on before with these guys, and they are stars. <laughs> couldn't have a Christmas show and not have their Christmas jackets on. Oh, that's right. I love that. And your other books, we should mention, are A Home for Harry and Lola, which started that whole ball roll. Right, exactly. And then you've got Harry and Lola, Lola with uh, Smokey the Magical Cat, Harry and Lola at the Sisters Rodeo, and then Harry and Lola in Scotland. Well, and what happened with, with uh, Harry and Lola uh, with Smokey the Magical Cat, that happened because uh, uh, Smokey spent so much time with Harry, but I said the cat must have magical powers. Mm -hmm. So, so the cat has magical powers in that. So then the next book is Harry and Lola go to Scotland, and in that book, Smokey passes his magical powers to Harry, mm -hmm. so that they can go to Scotland and they meet a dragon and they they heal the dragon's wing. So that really set up. A, a great situation for my then being able to have Harry and Lola in Santa Claus mm -hmm. because Smokey helps Harry and Lola get to Canada, northern Canada is where Santa Claus is. Oh. And and he so he helps them get to northern Canada to meet Santa Claus. And Santa Claus, what's, what's special about this is Santa Claus helps dogs in need on Christmas Eve. So like Santa Claus goes and gives kids toys, Santa Claus gives food to dogs in need. Oh, I love this. And so this is different. So you mentioned Santa Claus is a name that others have used before, and right. that one is different than those other books. Right, because in the, 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 uh, there's a series of kids' books that are for older kids mm -hmm. where Santa Claus is a German Shepherd and he saves people on Christmas Eve. And then Disney picked up and did a Santa Claus, which was Santa gets a puppy dog and he names him Paws and he goes to New York and the dog gets lost and that. So there's not been any kind of a story where you take Santa Claus and you make him a, a more or less an elf who does good but does it for dogs instead of 
So I'm hoping that, you know, I'll become a really new legend. <laughs> now, did you have a partner with this book? Yes, I did. This was wonderful. I had four of the books I wrote by myself, and I love to participate. Well, a friend of mine is a teacher who teaches teachers how to teach writing, and so she's a real talented writer. And I took a lot of arm twisting, but I got her, because she's very busy, mm -hmm. I got her to agree to uh, partner with me on the Santa Claus book. And she raised the level of writing, you know, to a much higher level than, because than, my, you know, it's, it's very different to write a story with dialogue and tension mm -hmm. versus what I used to write, which was, you know, how to uh, improve yourself type of books. It, that's, that's, much easier to write than this stuff. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> how much fun, though. No, because yeah. clearly you couldn't do this if you didn't love it. And you oh. how much fun you're having. <laughs> oh, well, these dogs are incredible. The, the, this pair is incredible, which is why we ended up adopting another rescue puppy. But uh, then, and I love kids. I don't have any grandkids. So this is a chance to get involved with kids, and the kids love the dogs, and the dogs are so good with the kids. I mean, what's not to love, not just like? I mean, this is, this is, this is, as long as my body will let me do it, this is what I'm doing the rest of my, I now know what I'm doing the rest of my oh, life. How <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> and what a too, because it gives so much to others. How do people find the Harry and Mobile book? They're on Amazon, uh, and they're on barnesandnoble.com. And all you have to do is search Harry and Lola. And then, of course, we have the Harry and Lola website, which is harryandlola.org. Uh, and so that can lead you to them. But the, the simple way, and they're very inexpensive. Look, right. It's like one woman said, well, gee, you get the whole set for $6. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right? Yeah. That's great. It is great. Yeah. And, and, and what's wonderful is that uh, uh, it, it's 40% uh, of that goes to Scotty Rescue, the other Amazon you know, or Barnes & Noble gets, but 40% because I don't take anything, um, there's no author royalty okay. going to us, it all goes to Scotty Rescue. So Rescue's. any of your profits go to? All of, all of it goes to Scotty Rescue and it's great. <laughs> well, and you're going to be, we're running out of time, but you're going to be a couple places in December, December 18th at Sisters Elementary School. Right. You're going to be reading to their kindergarten classes and then December 24th, a special reading at the Blackfeet Ranch Lodge. Yeah, so please, that would be a great way to, it, at 1 o'clock, so it's an early, so you come and have a, a hot chocolate at, at the Blackfeet Ranch Lodge and get a Christmas story read to you. Yeah, and a wonderful, wonderful ride with the family. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> holidays together. And a beautiful view. Oh my gosh, <laughs> for sure. So as Jean mentioned, the Harry and Lola website is harryandlola.org. You can get there, find out more about these guys, more about Jean, and the books as well. Otherwise, Amazon and Google.com. So Jean, it was great to see you. Oh, thank you so much thank for having me along. Thank you.